Crossing. Hunter and Sophia and I will all went to Starbucks this morning to get the Taylor drink. It was so good. Well, Central, today is Red, Taylor's version day. And it's such a good album. I was jamming out all morning. Well, there's another big announcement, and that is Sadie Stortz is releasing an EP named Any Other Way. It comes out November 20th. We also want to thank, again, thank our theater department for the last weekend show. Here's one last look. Uh, and, like, when I was, like, being friendly to you, that, like, wasn't coming on to you friendly. Like, I don't, I don't like you. I'm not like that anyway. I'm, like, sure, I'm sure you're super magnetic for certain types. Like, oh, but, like, you're not, like, my yow, you know? Um, I just wanted to say I don't care whether you're, I mean, like, who you, like, I, it's none of my business. Cool. <laughs> Do you want to make it your business? Well, I mean, because I got this app and it, got, it gave me a name and, and I love to, I'm going to confirm that I love to have like a backup, like a second and dual, like a pin, no pistols at dawn yet anyway, but like maybe would you want to meet me by the juice machine at lunch? Okay. I know this was a fun performance. Congratulations to our actors and crew members. You did a great job. We'll look forward to seeing you all again in the spring for Mary Poppins. Well, I remember it all too well about the cold weather today. Is there anything you can tell us if it's going to be warmer at all today, Anna? Weather with Anna. You need a couple singing lessons, because that's not it. Hey, Central. I was definitely glad I grabbed my coat before coming to school this morning. Let me tell you about the rest of the day. But first, let's hear some important news from meteorologists Amy and Emma. I'm Amy Thompson, reporting live from Central Crossing High School. Today it's cloudy with a chance of... Yearbooks? You forgot to order your yearbook. You heard, Emma. Order your yearbook at Johnson's.com. You heard them. Order your yearbooks today. While it might be raining yearbooks over there, over here is going to have a 30 to 50 percent chance of rain from 5 to 9. Today we'll also have a high of 55 and cool down to a low of 32. Speaking of cooling down, the weather over the weekend is literally going to be freezing. Saturday and Sunday will both have highs in the low 40s and a low around 30. I've also heard there's a good chance it might snow on Sunday. Winter's already here, how exciting! And great news! The air quality will be excellent today, how exciting! Bundle up and head outside to enjoy the air quality before it rains. The good air quality before it rains. Well, that's all for me today, Central. Back to you, Anchors. Thanks, Anna. Well, let's talk about what is going on around here. First of all, thank you to everyone who helped out with the blood drive. We collected 37 units of blood, saving 111 lives. Good job, Central Crossing Comets. Well, next up, remember that Monday starts a canned food drive, so go out and stock in some canned goods to help other people in the community. Last year, amid hybrid craziness, Central brought in 2,301 cans and beat all the other high schools in the district. This year, we are excited for a return of a more normal schedule and an opportunity to get closer to our previous totals of 6,000 to 9,000 cans. That's a lot of cans. Also coming up is Pancakes with Santa on December 4th. There will be crafts for the kids, hot chocolate bar, and more. Come out and see Santa and his helpers. I know I will. Well... Let's talk about clubs over the next few days. GSA, or Gay Straight Alliance, is the place to help change perceptions about gender and sexuality. They meet in room 264 at 3.30 tonight. Also meeting tonight is Chess Club. All skills levels are welcome. The club meets in room 180 after school. Central, get involved. Now, let's head over to sports with Kai Kai and Logan. Good morning, Central. We have your sports news. First up, let's talk about what's going on during our offseason. The Special Olympics is coming back, and they are looking for basketball players and cheerleaders. We will also have a parent meeting tonight. See Mrs. Russell in the counseling office for more information. Any boy interested in playing tennis for the Comets this spring, please report to the cafeteria immediately after school today for a quick meeting. Also, we have wrestling getting underway. Plan to join this award-winning sport here at Central. All body types are welcome. Plus, Lady Comets, you are also welcome to join this sport. This is a legacy sport for us Comets. The first practice is today. See Coach Ramirez with questions. The swim team is also hiring lifeguards for practices and meets this season. 
Students with a lifeguarding certification or those interested in being certified who would like to pick up a few extra hours of work should see Miss Jacobs in room 260. Next up, we have some congratulations to send out. Our Lady Comets soccer team recently celebrated the end of another successful season with their team banquet. Shout out to two more of our seniors. Senior four-year varsity letter winner and team captain Kate Henry earned honorable mention OCC in their Lady Comets Pride and Perseverance Award. Senior four-year varsity letter winner and two-year team captain Krista Phillips earned the OCC Scholar Athlete Award for having the highest grade point average on the team with a 3.95. Krista has signed and committed to play collegiate soccer at Defiance College in the fall. Then, here's what's happening tonight. Boys freshman, junior varsity, and varsity basketball teams are at home against Worthington Kilbourne High School. Here's a look at the boys in practice. Oh, yo. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Switch. Shoot my shot. Shoot my shot. Shoot my shot. I ain't gonna miss. I'm gonna splash. I'm gonna flinch. Are you gonna stop my water, my dread? You can try, but you ain't taking me alive. You ain't taking me alive. So give me my spot. I ain't gon' sit. Shoot on my shot. I ain't gon' miss. You ain't never seen no one do it like this. If you say you did, then you's a lie, lie, lie. You ain't taking me alive. I believe I can fly. I believe anything could be achieved when applied yeah. Gotta reach for the sky right. Wanna do it, but I never had a reason to try Do you believe in a lie? Yeah. Want something so bad it could eat you alive? Yeah. I see the grief in your eyes yeah. Pray that opportunities might reach you in time But I came too far to give up now, now. Work too hard to get stuck now. Every corner I turned, I was turned down. turned down Had a look at my life like what now? Express myself, I shut Looking good, guys. Good luck tonight Also, here's what's happening this weekend Girls Junior Varsity and Varsity Basketball are playing at home against Hudson High School. That's all we have for you today, Central. Back to you, anchors. Thanks, guys. Now, let's go to Sophia for some important info about the month of November. Good morning, Central. November is Vegan Month. The Vegan Society began in 1944, and they participate in a 100% cruelty-free lifestyle. Commonly mixed up with vegetarians who don't eat meat, vegans take things a step further and get rid of all animal products from their diet meaning they avoid things like fish, eggs, milk, and honey, while also trying to avoid things like fur and leather. So whether you are vegan for health reasons, some do it just to help the animals and the environment. Or maybe you're not vegan at all. But everyone, and I mean everyone, is encouraged to try some vegan pancakes. Bosco is, in fact, vegan, and he loves them. So you will, too. That's all from me. Back to you, anchors. Wow. Thanks, Sophia. Personally, I wouldn't eat vegan pancakes. I feel like it would be fun. You're saving the animals. Think of all the piggies and cows you're saving. Well, we are so glad to be comments. And so glad to be at this school. Well, have a great day. Stay safe this weekend, Central. Bye. Bye.